There are four main parts to diadem. Window control, the viewing window, the menu bar, and the toolbars. The window control is where windows pertaining to compound data are managed. Think of it as a menu for each compound you've selected. Each time a new compound is selected from the database, it is automatically added to the window control. The window control can then be used to access windows such as the data windows, the structures window, the prediction package, and the regression window. Windows accessible through the window control that are not compound specific include the user database add edit form, the compound comparisons page, and the options form. To make viewing data and selecting windows easier, menus on the window control can be expanded or collapsed by clicking the menu heading, as shown here. Using the sort button located above the window control, users can choose to display compounds in order of name, dipper ID number, molecular weight, or grouped by families. Compounds may be removed from the window control using the filter button. The viewing window is where the action really happens. Once a window is selected in the window control, it opens here. Most windows in Diadem can be resized to fit in the viewing window the way you want. Windows may also be maximized or minimized. Diadem has three ways to arrange windows. Windows can be arranged in cascading format, tiled vertically, or tiled horizontally. To change how the windows are displayed, select the Windows menu and choose from one of the three options. The Windows menu also contains an easy way to find the window you're looking for. When working on a project, it is not uncommon to have several windows open at once. To easily find a specific window, click the window name on the windows menu. The selected window will be brought to the front of the stack. The menu bar is located at the top of Diadem. There are eight menus on the menu bar. The file menu is used to change the databases linked to Diadem, change the compounds opened on startup, and to print. The Edit menu is used to copy and paste information, access the user database Add Edit page, and open the Options window to personalize Diadem. The View menu allows users to switch between Diadem's regular and quick views, as well as select which options are displayed on the toolbars and in the window control. The Format menu gives users the ability to change the units Diadem uses, as well as add their own set of units to the program. The Format menu is also used to select one of Diadem's six color schemes. The Tools menu is the backbone of Diadem. From this menu, users can access references and notes in the database, view equations, choose from a variety of tools for database evaluation and manipulation, and access essentially every tool in Diadem. More information pertaining to the specific features located on the Tools menu is available under various sections of this tutorial. As previously explained, the Windows menu is used to format how windows are displayed in Diadem's viewing window. The About menu gives BYU Dipper 801 staff's contact information, as well as the version number for Diadem. Help in using Diadem, as well as answers to many questions, can be found by clicking the Help menu. Diadem contains several toolbars to speed up your data viewing process. The first toolbar is the Database Toolbar. The Database Toolbar is where you tell Diadem which databases to search and extract information. The Search Toolbar is used for quick searches. The exact name, Dipper ID, Chemical Abstracts Registry Number, 
or the formula of a compound can be used to quickly find a compound in the database and register it in the window control. These are lightning buttons. When a lightning button is depressed, the associated window will open for each compound. Additionally, any new compounds added to the window control will automatically open to the selected window. When a lightning button is released, all associated windows close. This toolbar is used to quickly change the temperature dependent property in use in all open windows. For example, if I had a variety of temperature dependent windows open and I wanted to quickly view data for liquid vapor pressure, selecting liquid vapor pressure from this list changes all temperature dependent windows to display data for that property. Similarly, the prediction toolbar can be used to change the prediction method or the property in all the prediction windows. Clicking the method or property button will change the prediction windows selection mode to select by method or select by property. For more information on the prediction windows, see prediction package under the advanced section.